What is up YouTube? Welcome back to the page. It's your boy Eric Richardson. Today, this video is gonna be a little bit different. You're actually gonna step in the day of the life with me. I've been having people reaching out and they're like, now I have 20 streams of income. Before I had 15 streams of income. They're like, how do you manage all of this? Like. How is that even possible? Like it's one thing for you to, you know, tell us and list out your streams of income, but we want to see how you manage it. So today, that's what I'm going to do. This isn't going to be like those typical videos where the content creators record themselves getting out of bed. Now I do make my bed every morning because we got to start the day off with the win. My balcony, they're doing renovations. I would show y'all because I have a very nice view in San Juan, Puerto Rico. I moved my company out here. So for those of you who do not know in Puerto Rico, they have tax incentives for entrepreneurs to come out here and bring their businesses and I have a whole bunch of businesses so a lot of my businesses are exporting services all right so for example I have my call center with my foreclosure business we're exporting that service I'm a content creator I'm exporting that service I have consultations I manage Airbnbs I do a lot of different things you guys are gonna go in and see exactly how you know my day operates it's currently 9 10 all right so I got my first meeting at 10 o'clock I don't really wake up too early I don't have no crazy morning routine. I'll probably drop a video on my morning routine, but you know, I, I have a lot of other successful friends that are my age. Well, not a lot, rather, only a few because there's only a few that I can relate with, but everybody has different paths. I have some friends that my boy Josh, he wakes up at like 5 a.m. and he hits the ice bath. Like that works for him. That's great for him. I have another friend where he just wakes up whenever he feels like it and he's making six figures a month just like me. So you got to pick your routine that works for you. Me personally, I wake up an hour before my first meeting so let's say for example if I had a meeting at 8 then I'll wake up at 7 it's different because I'm a late worker at night well, actually I, I work all day y'all about to see I work all damn day especially on Mondays Mondays is my tough days I like to grind it out on Mondays we're not gonna hit the gym just yet I'm, I'm dressed ready gonna bang out these meetings then we're gonna hit the gym so I'm gonna show you guys how I prepare for my day let's get it all right guys, so this is my studio. I set this up, I have the lights, I have a ring light, those accent lights, I got chairs, I got this, another lamp, the sound cancelers, I got my whiteboard. You guys can see the view is okay on this side. For my balcony is very good, but anyways guys, this is where the money is made. Now, these last few weekends, I'm gonna show you guys, it's been, my handwriting is sloppy, but I'm just showing you guys. Okay, so this was Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Like I literally, work all the time what keeps me going is the fact that every day i outline what i need to do and i move forward okay so like on normal days i'm typically doing 14 to even 20 things that i have to get done a day these are money earning activities i told you guys over 70 percent of my day is money earning activities we look at friday friday there was 13 things now friday is typically a day to have fun so on the weekends i'm not gonna do as much but i'm still gonna get stuff done saturday six things but today y'all about to see today's about to get crazy all right so y'all can see how i plan my day for starters i'm gonna go to zoom and see how many meetings that i have initially today so gotta start off with the to-do list we got a meeting at 10 a.m i created a crm for my business to make users in my community uh get more deals manage their deals be more effective get leads we've been working on that constantly working on it improving it making it better for everybody so we have a meeting at 10 a.m so that's going to be with David Corliss. Then I have a meeting at 11 a.m. That's with my call center. So we assist people after foreclosures. We also help people with unclean funds at the state level. And we also assist people with unclean funds after bankruptcy. So I have an asset recovery firm. I have over 60 employees. We have cold callers. We have regional managers. And then we have directors of operations. We have a research team. And we also have a uh, processing department. So it's a pretty big operation. Every Monday morning, we do a meeting because this is how you continue to have forward momentum, no fall off, no drop off. It doesn't matter how big your team is, you need to have weekly meetings so that everybody can be structured. So we got that meeting at 11. Then at 12, I have a meeting with one of my students. So I have a new service. Um, I teach the business that I'm in. People can sign up, they can learn, they can do it by themselves. They can hop in my community where we do two calls a week with an attorney, we do workshops, basically teaching them exactly how to do the business. But I do have a service where I'll set that business up for you because it's one thing to learn what to do. Not everybody is capable of doing everything on their own. So I created a service where I'll set up your business 
business for you. We'll get you your training staff. We'll basically replicate what I have with my call center with them, but on a smaller scale. So at 12 o'clock, I have a call with them. After that, we're gonna hit the gym. We're definitely gonna hit the gym. After I hit the gym, now I'm gonna tap into my creative side. I learned this when I first started doing everything. It, it was more of like me doing everything, like bottlenecking in it, and I worked very hard. I'm still gonna be working hard, doing a lot of things, but now, as you guys are gonna see, it's more of my mind going to work. I'm doing meetings, I'm giving knowledge, I'm giving information, things of that nature. So after the gym, I have to tap into this new product that I'm coming out with. I can't release that, but I'll go ahead and put it here. That's a hidden thing, we're gonna work on that. We do have to check check in <clears throat> every day we have to check finance check finances so we're going to check finances across the board <clears throat> you guys are going to see all the different streams of income we're going to check finances we're going to go through that and then after that i do have a few other meetings so we're going to go over the ai that we have installed now we're going to go over that i have to dedicate time to check emails then i have another call tonight at 7 30 with another student then i have a call at nine this is going to be with my facebook group my community i've got to give them that value so i'm an author i have a paperback version of my book but i'm working on the audio version of it and developing a marketing plan for it so that i can get more sales on Amazon. If you guys haven't gotten it yet, go ahead and check it out. It's called The Power of Doing More. I teach you guys how it went from 40,000 in income to over 400,000 in income in one year, simply by applying all the methods of doing more. And in that book, it's gonna teach you exactly how to do that. So right now, it's 9.20 a.m. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven 10, 11 items that need to get done. done we got two new tasks that we gotta do we gotta come out with some new tutorial videos we are coming out with um an update on the ui and then also we need to update something with the auction calendar so i just got two new tasks that i just added to my sheet now i was working on the document that i'm preparing for my meeting with my call center so with the call center every monday meeting that i do we start with motivation and then after that we get on the highlights and then we go over our pending deals. So we had 10 deals last week. We had five out of those 10 confirmed as good to go. The other five, there were like some issues with the claim. We couldn't actually move forward with it due to a lien holder or possibly they've already been claimed, which is fine. Five is pretty good. We have some pending deals where we sent out the agreement form and we just need those documents signed. So uh, we're gonna get on that. And then we have areas to improve on with the team and then we're gonna get into it. So that next meeting is in about 30 30 minutes. I'm fasting until I'm done with my meetings. I took my creatine. I take um, cayenne pepper with honey. I take ashwanda. I take biotin. And then I got the creatine and just on the water. And that's it for now. And then I'm going to work out. After I work out, I'm going to get some fruit in my system. All right, so that meeting went great. I gotta get this fruit in because still got time where I consider fasting not a real meal, but I'll get my fruit and my water in. But the meeting I just had with my team was very productive. We went over a lot of things that we need to improve on. We went over a lot of success areas too. And then also I like getting feedback on their end because like I see everything from a broad spectrum because you know I'm the president of my firm, I'm the CEO. There's macro managing and micro managing. So I delegate a lot of tasks, but I still have to oversee and look things. So it was good feedback and we're just gonna keep moving forward, moving forward. Ideally, the goal is to be the biggest firm in the nation in this business. It is a niche that a lot of people don't know about. We had a lot of claims paid out this month already. In a little bit, I'm gonna total up the income for this month. It's been great. The thing is just gotta keep going, keep moving forward, keep moving forward. Got one more meeting, then I can go lift. That's gonna be with Jay. So um, a little bit about that. He purchased the asset recovery system. All right, guys, so now I'm headed to the gym. I don't like to like wake up and then go work out immediately because I, I gotta be productive when it comes to my money earning activities. Working out is the crucial aspect of my day. Um, you know, health is wealth. 
So today I got chest and back, cardio and abs. And this is where it really always starts, guys, in the gym. Like when I'm in the gym, body's feeling right, feeling confident, everything's rolling good. I noticed that a lot of people who don't work out, they have self-confidence issues, they just don't feel good about themselves. And all of this stuff translates into business. Like if I'm feeling good, I'm feeling healthy. Business is feeling good, moving forward. Copy my steel. Face the fact that ain't no cap, I'm real. Ain't no cap, I'm real. The plastic bars wanna copy my steel. Copy my steel. Face the fact that ain't no cap, I'm real. Ain't no cap, I'm real. Right, what an amazing workout. So, guys, in my book, I teach that one of the ways that you can get a lot of accomplished is by multitasking. And when I'm at the gym, I answer emails so that I can kind of kill the next task that I have. But also I get hit up a lot. Like my phone was getting blown up. I was getting a lot of emails and I'm like, yo, relax. Like, we live in a society now where people want stuff immediately all the time. Man. That's just not how it works, man. But the work was good. You can see the sweat dripping off the beer. Got some great work in today. Chest and back, abs, cardio. Now I'm about to walk home, change real quick, go to the hotel where we're having the surface funds convention at, check it out, talk to them, grab lunch. Still haven't eaten yet. And then, so this is where the event is it's really nice out here the guy that i was talking to just now at the front desk man he had terrible energy i try to stay away from people with bad energy like that but you guys can see it's very beautiful here just waiting on the lady to come and show me that nice ballroom that i've already paid for you know the thing about being young and having money is a lot of people don't believe you got money so when you step into certain places and you know these individuals are older than you they just are envious and they're jealous but it's all good you know just got to keep pushing they can't believe that somebody my age is you know renting out the entire banquet room for real estate convention so it's all good but yep we're here everything looks great this is where the convention is going to be at the royal semester it's beautiful out here everybody that's coming looking forward to seeing you guys soon You guys have a projector, right? Actually, that is that will be separate. Separate, okay. company. Mm -hmm. No, but you guys have that as an option, yes, right? Yes, we do. Okay. So I haven't eaten all day. I'm about to go crazy. I'm getting wings for starters, and then I'm getting this combo. Gotta eat good. All right, guys. So it is currently 4:10. I just got back from my lunch and. I've got a lot done today. We had the 10 a.m. meeting, that's done. We had the 11 o'clock group call with the call center, that's done. We had the 12 o'clock appointment with Jay, that's done. We hit the gym, that's done. We went to the Royal Senesta to check out the spot where the convention is, that's done. I informed the VAs about the auction calendar, um, something that we're updating. Just got some new tasks that I have to do. Right now I'm going, I need to check on the um, some of the mailers that are gonna be sent for our company. So, so far that's one, two, three, four, five, six, that'll be seven things. And we still got a lot more to do. So it's like halftime during the day. Most people are done and they're tired and they give up, but there's a reason why, you know, success is just oozing because constantly moving forward, guys, every day, there's things that need to be done. So we gotta get it done, we gotta get it done. It's time to go over finances. So today alone, I've made a little over $3,000 in transactions and passive income. And I'm just gonna break down the month to date numbers. For starters, we'll start with the asset recovery business. This is going to be my commission. We did have four deals that were paid out. We have two more deals that are actually pending. that will probably get paid by the end of the month, but that ended up totaling 13,000 that's going to be commissioned for my company paid out the total amount of recovery that we did is well over um, 85,000 just for August alone 
will probably recover over six figures in August. So that's 13,000. We have a combination of the Facebook group plus my asset recovery uh, system. That is a high ticket offer. Keep in mind that is a $6,000 product. The Facebook group is $20 a month. I do have over 700 people in that group. That is bringing in 54,000. Then we have the CRM that's bringing in 17,000. This is month to date. So the end of the month is gonna be higher. I do partner with this other company. I get paid um, affiliate, that's 5,000. Turo's been slow this month, only $600, but I primarily use Turo for um, a tax write-off. Airbnb this month was slow as well. In the summertime in Florida gets kind of hot and we have a hurricane coming up. So that's 11,000. YouTube brings in enough to, to pay for rent. Honestly, it brought in uh, 1,950. Financial advising, this is the last month that I actually worked at my firm. Brought in 6,500. I'm no longer working there because I'm just dedicating full time to the new high ticket offer that I have so I can do those meetings and stuff. And then we also have the course. The course brought in 24,650. So the total amount month to date is $130. $33,700 and that's not including some other um, YouTube money that I have on my travel channel and then a uh, little miscellaneous streams of income that I have but month to date we're over 133 so I mean things are going good guys I, I cracked the, the six figure mark per month back in uh, March and ever since then, there was no looking back. I have been traveling a lot, but in Puerto Rico, I have to stay here for more than half the year so that I can get residency. So I'm pretty much gonna be locked in for the rest of the year. And I said, nothing less than 100,000 each month until we get to December. I mean, honestly, for the rest of my life, I don't plan on making less than 100,000 a month. So those are the numbers, guys. Gotta pop it off with the fruit. Got the juicer, so we need some fruit. Now last time I grabbed one and it had some mold on it, so. I gotta make sure I make a correct selection this time. That looks great. Uh, get some food, get some vegetables. Let's see, I'm gonna just load up on chicken as hell. 423. I'll just start with these. All right, y'all. So for less than $100, we got all the essentials, eggs, water, fruit, vegetables, chicken, rice, seasoning, sauces, watermelon, chocolate chip muffins, vegan though. You know what I'm saying? Eating real good for less than 100 bucks. I don't know how long this going to last me, but it hey, should be at least a few days. Now, so a few things really quickly. The day can change just like that, all right? So I had a client reach out to me. They were interested in the high ticket offer that I do where I set up their business. They've been seeing a lot of my students have been having success and my success as well, guys. And it's literally the same blueprint, the, the same whole operation that I have, I set up for people. So the client hit me up, we just got paid on that. I'll show that there. So now today's income, previously I told you guys it was about like 3,000. Now we just got that, so that's another 6K. So guys, this is gonna be a 10, K plus day, everything is going great. And another thing too, just got notification. We got the signing on a $58,000 surplus in Georgia at 30% from the call center. Um, we just talked about it in the meeting about follow-up, follow-up, follow-up. This case was from August 12th, where we initially sent out the introductory email, spoke to the client and everything, and then they did a great job at following up. And we just got that signed. Some deals, some people are ready to go, but then others, you gotta follow up. Up, you got to keep explaining and then they come on board but I mean guys if we're looking at 30% on 58,000 that's 17,400 so we got to pay the attorney there's extra costs um, associated with it but you know the company's gonna bring you know good good money that's good work on that uh, a lot of people always like man like what keeps you going like how are you able to do all this and I talk about it in the book that's why it's called the power of doing more I highly recommend getting the book every day you wake up with the opportunity and the ability to mold the life that you want. So if you can see and plan out exactly what you want, there's gonna be a formula to get there, all right? We all can say, oh, I want to, let's say you wanna start an asset recovery business. I wanna start a service funds business. So that's the vision. Then we make the plan, okay, well, in order for me to do that, I need to start my business, get the domain, get the website, get the business bank account, get this, get that, get all these little pieces 
then you have the steps. Okay, if I need to do that, then this is what I do. This is the steps. So like every day I have my tasks. You guys see I'm going through and I'm just outlining exactly what I want. The vision's already there. The plan is already there. Now it's just time to execute. Every day you just do something. MBA, money, earning activities. So right now we're gonna get this thing cranking. I mean, of course I'm tired guys. Like I barely sleep. You can probably see it in my eyes, see it in my face. Like I wake up, I'll be so tired, but I gotta keep going right now. The plan is seven more years grinding like this, and then I can retire from doing a lot of this stuff, but mainly focus on like content because I know y'all gonna start loving these damn lives. Content and then the consultations because I'm truly helping people. Like, it's one thing I could hoard my knowledge and just have my call center, but I love it when other people are having success, when they go through my program, when they close deals, when they get the asset recovery system, then their whole business is operating the correct way. I love doing that. I, I get more fulfillment out of teaching these individuals exactly what to do. So, you know, things are just, things are rocking and rolling right now. We got, right now at 6.30, I got another meeting at 7.30. Then we got the Facebook group at nine. We do have a marketing strategy with the book. I also have to speak with my boy Chris on the AI and I have a few emails to check. Oh, I must be allergic to being mediocre because I gotta do some work. You gotta keep it going. We got five more things to do. I already did 10 things. I'm gonna put some music on, hype me up because you know the energy can get low, it can kind of get low, but when things come in, we just got those payments. The daily transactions is going up. You know what I'm saying? The energy is coming and the execution is here, guys, because I pray for this. This is literally what I pray to God every night. I pray for execution. I pray for the ability to be great. I pray for the visions, the work ethic, the want to succeed. Like this is a privilege to be able to have to do 15 things in one day. This is a privilege to be able to do this work then generate over 10,000 in one day to make six figures in a month. All of that is just being able to let God use me as a vessel. Come in, give me the strength, give me the knowledge, give me the work ethic, give me the ability to succeed, and then I just keep going. I'm unstoppable that way. Like, honestly, like, you guys are witnessing this on the vlog. Like, this is day to day. It's all thanks to God. Let's get it. All right, y'all. So one thing that I am hype about today as well is I passed 18,000 subscribers on YouTube. The YouTube has been growing. Thank you, everybody, for supporting. One day, I'm going to get to where I can get that plaque, and I can't wait. But we just got a video um, edited from my videographer, and he's been, man, he's been getting the content super high quality. So check it out. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to my page, Money Maker Juggernaut. I'm your host, Eric Richardson, the number one educator in the asset recovery business. Today, I have a great video in store with you guys. I am going to break down, should you be making calls on the weekends? This yep, so guys, y'all check that video out, but things are, are definitely turning up on YouTube. Guys, we're bringing stuff out. We're getting to it. 
So that call went amazing. It's currently 1020. I'm about to cook. Then I'm gonna relax. Guys, we started at nine. We got done at like 1030 and made over 10,000 today. Close deals, help people close deals. There's a lot of blessings going on. If you guys like this video, hit the like button, share it, let your friends know. I'm coming out with more and more content. Thank you for watching.